care for you, no one will think about you till her last breath, the only person do all the things for us and we called it, mother. We never know the love of a parent till we become parents ourselves. Let parents bequeath to their children not riches, but the spirit of reverence. When you look into your mother's eyes, you know that is the purest love you can find on this earth. A parent's love is whole no matter how many times divided. Love as powerful as your mother's for you leaves its own mark to have been loved so deeply will give us some protection forever. The best inheritance a parent can give his children is a few minutes of his time each day. Children begin by loving their parents, as they grow older they judge them, sometimes they forgive them. There is no such thing as a perfect parent. So just be a real one. First your parents, they give you your life, but then they try to give you their life. There's nothing like your mother's sympathetic voice to make you want to burst into tears. Parents are the bones on which children cut their teeth. All that I am, or hope to be, I owe to my mother. To understand your parents' love you must raise children yourself. Parents aren't the people you come from. They're the people you want to be, when you grow up. Behind every young child who believes in himself is a parent who believed first. A good father is a source of inspiration and self-restraint. A good mother is the root of kindness and humbleness. It is time for parents to teach young people early on that in diversity there is beauty and there is strength. Parenthood, it's about guiding the next generation and forgiving the last. My parents are my backbone. Still are. They're the only group that will support you if you score zero or you score forty. So much is asked of parents, and so little is given. Parenting is a lifetime job and does not stop when a child grows up. You cannot let your parents anywhere near your real humiliations. The thing about parenting rules is there aren't any. That's what makes it so difficult. To my father, who told me the stories that matter. To my mother, who taught me to remember them. Step-parents are not around to replace a biological parent, rather augment a child's life experience. They're your parents. They're meant to love you because never in spite. In the happiest of our childhood memories, our parents were happy, too. The reasonableness of the command to obey parents is clear to children, even when quite young. No matter how far we come, our parents are always in us. The love of a parent for a child is continuous and transcends heartbreak and disappointment. Parents are like God because you want to know they're out there, and you want them to think well of you, but you really only call when you need something. The depth of the love of parents for their children cannot be measured. It is like no other relationship. It exceeds concern for life itself. The thing about lying to your parents is, you have to do it to protect them. It's for their own good. Parents can only give good advice or put them on the right paths, but the final forming of a person's character lies in their own hands. It's a sad moment, really, when parents first become a bit frightened of their children. Our parents' prayer is the most beautiful poetry and expectations. We don't always do the things our parents want us to do but it is their mistake if they can't find a way to love us anyway. What's it like to be a parent? It's one of the hardest things you'll ever do but in exchange it teaches you the meaning of unconditional love.